Hey guys, today we're doing a sound system in this F-350. So up front, we've already gone ahead and done our integration. We're using PAC Audio's AP4. Here's our reason for integration. So we're using the AP4 for, from PAC Audio. So this gives us everything that we need through an integration harness, nice and easy up front, saves us time. And then we're using a toss link to interact with our amplifier. You can see our Amp Pro from Pack Audio, so we have it attached over here, easy to take out and service. And then the integration harness or the T-harness goes in line between the display and the head unit. So Adam's already gone ahead and sounded in the door, so he cuts everything perfectly to fit the shapes. He's going to make an ABS panel over here to seal off, give us good enclosure. He's also built a new speaker adapter because we're putting in Blam 8-inch speakers. So he's used some of the factory hardware and he's also put in nut certs. That way he can mount this nice and solid. Now for the tweeters, we're using the A-pillars and the factory mounting points. What you might not notice though is Adam has gone ahead and laser cut everything. That way it fits perfectly using the factory holes and it fits nice and snug. So you see in the back here, Tyler's building a custom enclosure, doing it all out of MDF stacking some and putting some crazy angles on it. Most of the time when you see people build an enclosure, it comes up, may put an angle, but he's putting several in here, which is really cool. So in the back, I'm already doing our integration. So I grabbed all the speaker outputs off the factory amplifier. We're deleting the plug, basically putting it back so we don't lose it. And I will use thicker wire for the woofers and then thinner wire. That's why you see two colors doubled up. Because the vehicle is aluminum, we have gone ahead and run a ground all the way to the battery. And then we're using this as a junction point for our amplifiers. Okay, we have the board mocked up and go ahead and laser it out and save in the computer. Control knobs, we want it to fit perfectly flat in here. And there it is on the other side. We also want everything secure to make sure it doesn't rattle around when we're driving. See, Tyler and Adam have the enclosure all together now. Here's what the wiring looks like underneath. So the panel hides everything. It's all zap strap behind to be tidy and easy to service. Well, here you guys have it. Here's the enclosure that Tyler built. And you see he has the mirror acrylic in here. He has a bunch of design and a bunch of angles that we showed you guys earlier. And then we also studded it and we carpeted over it so it's bolted to the factory brackets.